Hey, it's Dr. Debbie with Veterinary Home Health Care, and I wanted to come and talk to you about another one of our blends for dogs. And this one is pretty much always sells itself with our online store at theblessedpetshop.com or our brick and mortar store. It's called Unyeast the Beast. Um, and it sells itself because the people that need this uh, recognize that they need it because it's a chronic problem and their dogs have suffered with recurrent yeast infections usually on the skin or sometimes the ears um, a common thing I hear is it's a very distinct smell it smells like Fritos I know sounds weird um, but a lot of people say they even call and say my dog's feet smell like Fritos true story um, and when they call that and, and they have that uh, complaint, I'm like, I know what that is, that's yeast. So um, it's not as easy to clear up as you would think. So we made this product to keep on hand. It's wonderful for maintenance. So if you have a dog with a yeast problem, um, if you would use this as maintenance in between, uh, well, hopefully it's not in between treatments. Hopefully you won't need treatments. If you can use this as maintenance, give a spritz on the feet. A lot of times the underarms area um, are a problem. Um, it can be on in skin folds. So if you have like a bulldog, um, the tail folds or the facial folds. Now you don't want to spray it into the eyes, but you can um, dampen a, a, a Q-tip swab or cotton balls and put the essential oil directly on there. They can lick this and not be harmed. They can groom the area. Um, it's beneficial if they ingest it. So um, if you have a dog with chronic yeast problems or around the ears, you can spray inside the ear flaps. Um, it's really good. It will help clear up a yeast infection and it's really recommended for maintenance um, for dogs that have recurrent yeast infections. You definitely want your dog to be on this. The ingredients are orange, lavender, oregano, marjoram, peppermint, helichrysum, and tea tree. And um, this is already diluted and ready to go. A little bit goes a long way. So this bottle should last you a very long time. And if you have any questions about it, um, please let me know. And I'll be glad to answer those questions. And as always, thank you for listening.